children every day is a chance to learn something new let today be the start of something new hi children i am going to show one picture are you ready yeah let's move to the picture children look at the picture what do you see in the picture you are seeing many things in the picture isn't it yeah will you list out the things you see in the picture yeah children see one by one sun tree car house boat river giraffe monkeys birds very good children yeah children we are seeing many things in this picture some of them are natural and some are man made isn't it likewise every day we are seeing many things around us some are natural and some are man made things isn't it for example house table chair fan box pencil mirror plate book dog cat tree bicycle car etc children can we touch the moon no we cannot can we touch the stars no we cannot can we see air no we cannot but air is present all around us isn't it all these things are called matter children everything you can see and touch is made up of matter children you may think why we are talking about matter yeah today's topic is matter today we are going to learn about states of matter this is the second unit of science children what is matter anything that occupies space and has mass is called matter children say after me anything that occupies space and has mass is called matter children what is mass mass is a measure of how much matter is in an object okay children the air we breathe the food we take and the water we drink all have matter in them do you know that even we are made up of matter the space occupied by an object is called its volume matter is made up of many tiny particles called molecules molecules are very small we cannot see with our eyes matter 
exist in three states they are solid liquid and gas children repeat after me solid liquid and gas yeah matter can exist as solid liquid and gas first solid solid is rigid rigid means not flexible okay children for example table chair box pencil apple and ball or some examples of solid we can see many examples solid occupies space solid has fixed shape solid has fixed volume okay children next one is liquid liquid is not rigid for example milk water petrol honey these are some examples of liquid liquid occupies space liquid has no definite shape it takes the shape of the container it has fixed volume next one gas gas is not rigid for example water vapor smoke gas cylinder spray these are some examples of gas it has no definite shape gases do not have fixed volume children once again i'll say you repeat after me solid is rigid solid has fixed shape solid has fixed volume liquid liquid is not rigid liquid has no fixed shape liquid has fixed volume gas gas is not rigid it has no fixed shape and no fixed volume